That's weird. I wonder what's going on. Oh dear God. This is the first time I have ever woken up and seen you idiots already in the living room. I am usually the first one down here. Well, I had trouble sleeping all because of the air conditioning suddenly not working. I feel as if the same happened with Shaggy, Scooby, and Daphne. Is there any way that we could get out of here? I think I have my chainsaw in the basement. Maybe it can help us get out of this situation. Did Vicky seriously have to take the freaking chainsaw? Gray. <laughs> Fred, there's a fire going on somewhere in the house. I know about the ongoing fire, but fine. I'll go find the source. Oh, so this is where the fire came from? Like dude, me, Daphne, and Scooby were trying to make some burgers for the whole gang to eat. We saw that your chainsaw was in the basement, so we only used half of the gas in it to start the fire. Wait, so you mean to say that there is still some gas left in my chainsaw? That only means... Daphne, we're lucky to have gotten out of the kitchen before the chainsaw exploded. I see. And while Fred was on fire, Velma managed to run into the kitchen and put out the fire, as well as the one that was started when we, along with Scooby, tried to make burgers. Speaking of Fred, here he comes now. Oh my god. Fred, look at yourself in a mirror. Ugh, fine. My eyebrows are burned off thanks to you. I thought you idiots knew not to leave a chainsaw next to a fire while it still has gas in it. But no. You thought it would be a good idea to start that fire with it to try and make burgers, leading to the smoke alarms going off. For Pete's sake, can we please think of something that can get us out of this situation? To be continued in part 3.